Hello everyone. Now index in index number we are going to start our last video of short sum. Short sums based on post of leaving index number. Okay. In previous video we completed last year partial Fisher Bowley and Marshall. Okay. So let's start our uh, question number one. As compared to the year 2012, the sale of three items has been increased by 60%. 110% and 120% in the year 2016. In relation to the total sale, if the sale of these three items are respectively 30%, 25% and 45%, find the general index number of sales. Okay, so simple sum is given for cost of living index number. Solution first, we have to take three items, write down items respectively 1, 2, 3 or A, B, C. You can take any one of uh, any A, B, C or 1, 2, 3, A, B, C. Sorry. Now, index number. Index number is increases 60%, 110 and 120%. So, 100 plus 60 equals to 160 of item A. 100 plus 110 equal to 210 and last one 100 plus 120 equal to 220. Okay. After finding index number, write down weight W. Respectively 30%, 25%, and 45%. And total sigma W is equal to 100. Okay. 45 plus 30 plus 25 equal to 100. Now find out IW. Product 116 to 30 480 uh, sorry 48 <coughs> 100 second 210 into 25 210 into 25 and 220 multiplied by 45 9900 0. therefore sigma iw equals to is equals to 9900 plus 5250 plus 4800 equal to 19950 okay now find index number. Index number equal to sigma w divided by sigma w and it is equals to 19950 divided by 100 equal to 199.5. Okay, so your answer 199.5. Second sum during a period cost of living index number is increases from 500 to 600 means uh, base year's index number is 500 and current year's index number is 600. If during that period the initial monthly salary of a person that means it is salary of base year or monthly means base month 4060 then what should be his increase his salary. So index number jam increase the MNO salary can increase the OGI. Okay, to salary increase the OGI. So our table banana ina kya first year write down year year base year and current year. Current year. Okay, we are forming one equation for this type of sums. Yadrako. A type na some important she, aaj type na some CLI ma mostly are. But I will talk about a fixed pattern kari na kiya, year, base year and current year. Okay. Uh, first write down index number here, index number. Index number of base year is 500. And index number of current year is 600. Okay. During that period, the initial monthly salary. Monthly salary equal to 4060. 
then what is increases of salary okay we have to find salary of current year then we can find increases in salary apne salary of this year is equals to question bana hai to so thase 4060 multiplied by 600 divided by 500 and it is equals to 060 into 6 divided by 500 cut kar diye 4872 rupees 4872 rupees okay now we have to find increases in salary therefore increases in salary is equals to okay new salary 4872 minus old salary 4060 rupees okay now the difference between both the salaries is subtract 4060 from main salary it is 812 rupees 812 okay Answer is given by 137.5, and it is a wrong answer, not correct answer. This is a wrong answer. Okay, correct answer is 812 rupees. Okay, so let's start our next sum. Okay, our next sum is for the year 2016, the average expense of middle class families is rupees uh, 8000, and for the same class of people, the cost of living index number of The year 2017 is 120. Then obtain. I go to our video show, but then obtain estimate of average expense of the families of the year 2017. Okay. See, we have a uh, lot of method to calculate salaries of 2017. Okay, because 120 is our index number of 2017. That means. If cost or expense is increases by twenty percent, then income should also be increases by twenty percent. And I give you a mummy, magaj mari mani, padwa nu apne. Aaj rite table prepare kariye. First of all, write down years. Base year is two thousand sixteen, and current year is two thousand seventeen. Okay. Here put down index number first. Index number base year index number is always taken as hundred and 2017 correct current year is 120. Okay, then by income or uh, what is given salary or income average expense expense is given expense or salary. कोई पन वस्तु आप लिए कर के salary वही तो अब तमे expense करो. And what is estimate expense in 2017? So we have to find estimate expense of 2017. Therefore, expense of the year 2017 is equals to so cross multiplication 8000 multiplied by 120 divided by 100. Zero zero cancel out. Twelve into eight ninety six and two zero nine thousand six hundred rupees is an expense of year two thousand seventeen. Okay, so any percentage increase or decrease is money. But on what type of equation? Banana is not our main chart type of question. Solve. But our next sum is very easy. Uh, the cost of living index number is six fifty. Means I is equals to six fifty. Okay, so then. I is given by six fifty, and sigma I W equals to sigma I W is equals to two one four five zero zero. Find the total expenditure. See expenditure means what means E into P, price into quantity equal to expense or expenditure. Okay, but we have to find. E zero Q zero because in cost of living index number we always have to find 
बीस इयर्स एक्सपेंडिचर ओके चल तो टोटल एक्सपेंडिचर is equals to what it is equals to total means sigma and expenditure means w we have to find value of sigma w okay so index numbers formula is i equal to sigma i w divided by sigma w okay therefore i 650 is equals to sigma i w 214500 divided by sigma w Now flip the position of 650 and sigma w, and we will get sigma w equal to 214500 divided by 650. Cancel करेंगे तो अपन चाल से therefore sigma w equal to total expenditure is equal to 214500 divided by 650. It is equal to 330. Therefore total expenditure equal to sigma w it is equal to 330. Our next sum is based on previous sum. If sigma i w equal to one four nine five zero, and sigma p zero q zero equal to sixty five, find the percentage increases in cost of living uh, expenditure. Okay, here cost of is given total expenditure. Okay, see in solution. First, sigma i w is given by one four nine five zero, and Sigma P zero Q zero equals to what? It is equals to sigma W. Sigma W equal to sixty five. Okay. Therefore, index number is equals to sigma I W divided by sigma W, and it is equals to sigma I W one four nine five zero divided by sixty five. Okay, and it is equals to One four nine five zero divided by sixty five equals to two thirty. Okay, but two thirty is index number, and the question is asking for uh, find the percentage increases in cost of living index number. Okay, so our next answer, next statement is therefore percentage. Increases in CLI is equals to two thirty minus one hundred percent. Okay, so our answer is it is one thirty percent. Okay. Okay. Now last sum of this unit index number. Okay. In current year, the production of three commodities is two times. 2.5 times and 1.25 times of the production of base year. If all three commodities are of equal importance, means A, B, C, आपने लिया के one, two, three ये importance के उसे equal importance obtain the index number of production. Actually here 19.6667 is given. I have some doubt because index number Is never 19.67. Okay, let us uh, calculate this sum. And the last part, we do here. Okay, solution. First, write down items. There are three time, uh, three types of items: one, two, and three. Okay. Now, index number: hundred, one hundred, and one hundred. Okay. Now, production is two times means multiplied by two, two point five times two point five into one point twenty five times. Okay, and we will get two hundred, two fifty, and one twenty five. Okay, now find out W. See, W is given by. Equal importance of all three commodities. So how can we put equal importance? Okay, you can put one, 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 two, 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 three, 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 four, 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 any number. But our easy to put a one, one, one. Sigma W equal to. Okay, now I W. 
IW, there is no change 200 into 1, 200, 250 into 1, 250 and 125 into 1, okay, equal to 125, that was sigma IW equals to okay. uh, 200 plus 250 plus 125, 575, 575, okay, now find out index number. Index number equals to sigma IW upon sigma W equal to 575 divided by 3. 575 by 3 equal to 191.67. 191.67. See here, 191, 1, it try to shake the answer, 191.67, so, okay. So, I hope you can have a video, so how to calculate short sums of index number. So, we will complete unit here, complete career share. Okay, now we will meet in next video with time series. Okay, analysis of time series, unit number 2.